Power World developers say that they have received death threats amid Pokemon ripoff claims. Obviously, that's not cool. But welcome to the internet. Prepare for trouble. Who's that Pokemon? It's Blabasaur. Welcome to the internet. This is what everyone gets death threats on the internet. This this is not worth crying about. Just enjoy the success. You're dominating Steam charts. You've already beaten all the heavy hitters from last year. And, and yep. we're still in January. And you've already beaten all the big ones from Dude. last year. So just enjoy your victory. To go out and cry that you're getting death threats. Motherfucker, I get death threats. I get death threats. Welcome That's to the dad. internet. There's, there's always one or two retards that go too far. Yeah. It's not worth um, fucking complaining about. Brother, he, in a couple of days, he has beaten games that were out all year in sales. In a couple of days. Just, if, if you're getting death threats and you don't, you know, you're sick of seeing it, just fucking mute. There's a mute button on chat. It's like, make it so, pe like, random people can't message you and stuff. But... I would just be sending photos. What I would be doing to the Death Rex is I would send photos. a photo of a tombstone that says Pokemon on it. Pokemon! Yeah, I, I, I really don't think this is worth crying about or anything. Just roll with it. Yeah. Yeah, come on, Just bro. roll with it. Just be like, yeah, we've had some Death threats, but there's always like <laughs> two fucking retards that ruin it for everyone, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's fucking spastic shit, but don't worry, chat. It gets even funnier. This game just keeps on giving, man. Naughty Dog developers say that the making that making a game is so hard, and Power World is cheating, and other developers seem to support him. So we have this guy here, Del Walker from Naughty Dog. My gut is telling me Power World was made nefariously. I just have no proof. Bruh, I have no proof, but they did it. We're talking about the same developers who just released The Last of Us 2 Remastered. And y'all want to say this is a cop-out? You want to say this is a fucking cop-out? <laughs> you fucking fat That's exactly why they're upset. This destroyed Last of Us 2 Remastered. I, I, I did this tweet the other day. I said, Ghost of Tsushima cucked Last of Us 2 when the, when the game first came out, and now Power World is cucking Last of Us Remaster. Yeah, this they, um... State of being cucked by whatever's coming out at the same time. I run it with Neil Cuckman. Dude, that's why they released it this year, because they thought it'd be easy pickings, right? They didn't think they had much competition. Yeah, they, they did not think there was going to be anything in January. Now, Power World was announced in 2021, okay? So they've been cooking. They've been working on this. To say this game came out of the blue is not exactly true. Yeah, no. This we... wasn't just like, oh shit, it just came out of nowhere. It's out next month. Yeah. They've been working not... on this for a while. They announced this a few years ago. But they were looking, well, Naughty Dog, I mean, was looking at this being January's wide open. Nothing's going to compete with us. Yeah. And then Power World says, oh yeah, we're coming out in January as well. And they got they, wrecked. They didn't, have, they didn't have anything to fucking say when the game was coming out but now that it's out they're destroyed it is so funny how salty some of these cunts get man it's i just like... want to read this part again sorry Mozart, but i want to read this again my gut is telling me power world was made nefariously i just have no proof what the oh, fucking they got some <laughs> they got some shampoo they got some conditioner mix it up fucking bam tell me he didn't just say that i, I just want to know how he thinks he got made they believe that there was AI with this game, and first of all, I wouldn't give a flying fuck if there was. Y'all need to go. They've come out and said that we we don't have fucking AI in the game, and there's no proof that they did. I don't think you need to use AI when you're just copying Pokemon designs. <laughs> yeah, I, literally. So which one is it? Is it AI or is it a ripoff? They don't know. They they're just throwing shit at at the wall, man, and hoping it sticks. You know what I mean? They just want everything, um... They're, they're jealous that like, an actual good made game is succeeding. Because now they have to put effort in. That's what they're, they're afraid of. Is, oh, fuck. Our dog shit games. Um... Uh, like, we gotta step up now. Dude, it... Dude, Power World is so fucking... 
awesome. Like last year, m remember all the dubs dog shit games had like fucking Star Wars, whatever. La what's that ginger one? Right, it was broken and shit, and they were told it was broken and shit, and it and it did mad sales. It is so good to see an actual good game succeed. I would like, I don't like uh, uh, Atomic Heart. Last year, it is it is one of like it is such a good fucking game, but it got fucked over by other dog shit games, right? Because all we were talking about is the dog shit games, and so Atomic Heart got put under that, even though it was probably one of the top five best games of the year, right? So it's so good to actually see a well built game fucking smash in charts. Usually it's dog shit games that kind of smash the charts, right? Because just like because they have the name like Star Wars or Hogwarts Legacy, right? But Ah, oh, it's so nice to see this actually fucking them up, man. I I don't get the anger. Oh no, they're just mad that they 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 make dog shit games and these random cunts made a banger. Yeah, and he's Japanese, so I detect racism. Ooh.